I have an updated list of my top seven altcoins you could buy now and become a multi-millionaire. Yes, and make a lot of money and a lot of big pumps. So what's up? As you can see, I've got a new crypto on the list today. Here it is, ZTX. Revealed it to the VIP membership a couple days ago. The buy alert went out at point, uh, 0.027, 2.7 cents. And now it's really pumping a lot. It's like I have influence or something like that. <laughs> like, duh. Of course you do. So the buy alert went out at 2.7 cents, and now it's really pump a lumpin That's cool, man. And I think it's still really good. This is a new Metaverse coin. It's kind of gaming-ish, but more so Metaverse. Chart looks extremely bullish, and the team is exceptional. I was really impressed with the team behind this. So yeah, ZDX pump a lump in. Um, my mint layer bag is really pump a lump in. I got my first bag of mint layer at five cents, and now it's at 49 cents. Hey, let's go. Who's making the pumps? Which crypto is pumping the most for you? Just like, let me know in the chat. What's been your biggest win lately? Like, which crypto have you really been making the huge pumps? Because obviously you probably made some pumps on multiple coins, but which one have you actually made the biggest pumps in that you're just the most excited about? I'm pretty excited for Mint Layer. I'd say lately for the past month, Mint Layer has been my biggest win because this is up from 5 cents to 50 cents. It's uh, it's almost a 10X. I mean, okay, four, 48 cents. It's, it's like a 10X. Man, this is nuts. So yeah, I got Mint Layer up here. Um, I've also got Joystream, I think is looking due for a breakout. Neon obviously has been seriously pumping. How much up am I up on, on Neon? Let's go see. Neon, I got in at seven cents a couple of months ago. And now it's at 51 cents. The the whole Solana ecosystem's been pumping. Bonk especially has been pumping and Solana has been pumping. And I think I've been giving too much crap to Solana. <laughs> Solana ain't that bad. So yeah, Solana ecosystem pumping the pump, the, the soul coins. The neon's kind of up quite a bit, seven cents to 51 cents, not too bad. I'm up, what is that, seven X. Uh, G file obviously pumping like always. I love it, man. Like my, my, my hello and my G file, they just don't go down. They just pump, you know, hello's pump. Whoa, hello's pumping. I think it's at the all time highs. Holy crap. So my hello bags are pumping. How's my G file? My G file bag also pumping. I can't even keep up. All the bags are just pump or lumping. This is crazy. I feel like the bull run is here, right? You know, it just feels like the bull run. When you hit a 5X, 10X in a month, that it feels like a bull run. Watch the 500X coin. It's clickbait. <laughs> yep, you got clickbaited. I said, it's ICP. <laughs> ML biggest retur return potential because of a low MC. Yes, it's a low MC, but also it has the worst tokenomics. So don't be uh, don't be um don't be misled by the fact that the market cap is lower. For example, um even though Hello is a bigger market cap, it has a smaller fully diluted market cap with better tokenomics. So it doesn't necessarily mean I mean yes and no. Like the low MC is good, but also you got to look at the fully diluted market cap. What is the mint layer fully diluted market cap? 195 million, which means that, you know, mint layer tokens are getting unlocked every month and it's going to bring the price down a little bit. So it's like mint layer has a lower market cap than hello, but a bigger fully diluted market cap than hello because mint layer has a lot of tokens that are locked up for the, the presale people and the VCs who hopefully won't dump on us. <laughs> It's like, please don't dump on us. We want pumps. <laughs> Can anyone say the two coins with a question mark? It's clickbait. I don't even know what it is. It could be anything. Sold my Caspa for Safe Moon and Terra Luna. <laughs> oh my God. Oh man, that's crazy, dude. It's the poo poo pee, pee coin. Yep. The question mark coin is the poo poo coin. There you go. Mint layer got you twerking lately? <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> the separate guy looks like an AliExpress version of CG. A cheap big nose copycat. <laughs> wow. That's a big insult. <laughs> Do you think future bull runs 
multiplier profits potential will decrease over time. Will this be the last big bull run? <laughs> no, Elon Musk. <laughs> no. <laughs> I hear this all the time. Like, oh, no, the pumps are running out. We're running out of bull runs. All the money's been made and crypto is done. It's not how it works, man. It's not. That's that's a myth, a misconception and a false belief. <laughs> This is not the last bull run. This is not the last pump. There's always a new pump around the corner. Actually, we're just getting started. Crypto moves so fast. Mikey B, my moderator. What's up, man? Also, my ultimate tier member. What's up? Great to see you here. Thank you for showing up. What's going on, people? What's happening? BL, my moderator as well. What's up? Thank you very much. Yeah, you guys got to check out the Crypto Galaxy VIP membership. First link in the description so you can buy your coins before they pump not after they pump if you want to buy before the pumps because i have 17,000 subscribers and like 800 members in my paid group so if you want to be ahead of all the 17,000 subscribers you're gonna get a slight edge with the group so i recommend just do it just join do it. otherwise you can buy your bags after they pumped Don't let your dream you actually think zdx can 500x you said they could so just do it. nothing's impossible like Shire would say, nothing's impossible. <laughs> Make your dreams come true. Just do it. So, Jacob, what's up, dude? My uh, VIP member, Jacob, says, Mint Lair is your biggest pump. Very nice, man. Congratulations. Austin getting some pumps on uh, ZDX. Cast Boy got the, the cast and the Mint Lair pumps. Very nice. Polker? I've never heard of that one. Uh, you said your biggest pump was Cardano. <laughs> Did Cardano even pump? How much is Cardano pumping? Cardano is terrible. That's the ultimate normie coin. I bought Cardano at two cents and then I sold it at a dollar. So I made a 50x. Dude, this is barely pumping. All right. It went from 37 cents to 59 cents. And if you bought the bottom, you would have bought a 25 cents. So you might have made a double. So you, you can make a double with Cardano, but uh, there's way more gains to be made on the micro caps. The Cardano sucks. Mikey says neon and mint layer. Bonk. Biggest money printer so far. Congrats. Bonk got listed on Uphold. So now the American normies can pump the bags. Holy pump a moly. What is happening? Oh my gosh. I'm kind of salty. I missed Bonk. Oh well. Holy pumps, dude. This is crazy. The market cap went from 11 million to 757 million in a month. Jeez. Yeah, Joystream going to have its day. You made more with Caspa. Yeah, dude, I, I've made so much profit with Caspa already. It's just, it's just insane. Caspa is the gift that keeps on giving. Where do you see ZDX going? Billions. Billions and billions, billions, and, billions, and, billions, and, billions and billions and billions. Lit Lab ZDX, yeah, Lit Lab pumping. Lit Lab ain't too bad. It's fine. Area and Peppy are still decent picks. Um They got kicked out because I have new picks. <laughs> I have ZTX and Mint Layer. But they're still good. I still have Area and Peppy. They're they're fine. Well, is it just me or is there a doubled comment? What the heck? Hold on, let me look at the comment. You see there's like a stack there's two comments hold on let me uh let me fix this Whoop. there we go okay damn cannot see the stream getting an error that's too bad i mean you can't see the stream gasp alliance thanks dude for the two dollars hello cg about their big call lfg I don't understand. Hello, CG, about their big call. <laughs> I really don't understand. Could you please clarify what this means? Are you talking about the Hello Crypto? In, uh, in general, thank you for the 1900 super chat. Appreciate it, man. Thank you very much. Ghost, what's up? Long time no see. Thank you for the $5 super chat. I remember when you were barely at 5k subs. I'm glad I get to see you grow and grow with you. Awesome, man. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. My channel used to be really small. I mean, it's still kind of small. I only have 17,000 subscribers. 
but it used to be really small. It seems like every time my crypto start pumping, I get more people watching me because they're like, whoa, holy crap. This guy actually has some decent calls like Caspa. Every time Caspa pumps, more people find my channel. It's great to be growing it. This is just the beginning. Once Caspa is going to hit a dollar and then it's going to be dude. once Caspa hits a dollar, my channel is going to absolutely explode. There's going to be a ton of people. Lee Kalofi, thank you for the $10 super chat. And no, not no, with the Jesus God, coin. Please, no, no. It's still a scam. Mm. You can have a scam coin that pumps. Yes, but it's not going to pump forever. It's going to rug uh, one day eventually. Nobody wants your stupid freaking Jesus coin, man. Get out of here. Get out. Man, it's a huge disrespect to Jesus and every religion to make a coin after a, a religion or a figure. Like, it has absolutely nothing to do with the actual Jesus or Christianity. Like, seriously, it's a huge disrespect to make cryptos after a religion when there's no clearly no affiliation. Like, you're just using the name of Jesus to pump the bags of the insiders who created the token. It's a huge disrespect. So get out. Uh, you said Mint Layer was number one altcoin on... Te yeah, Token Metrics called Mint Layer as a number one. And that's the reason Mint Layer's been pumping. So shout out to Token Metrics, guys. Thank you so much for pumping my bags. Thank you very much. We'll take the pumps. Token Metrics, they listed um, Mint Layer as their number one pick. Uh, just based on things like uh, the technical reviews, the white paper, the team. Uh, also, the current market cap size. They found... Token Metrics found Mint Layer at 9 million market cap. I found Mint Layer under 2 million market cap. Because right here is, uh, here, here's when I first found Mint Layer was right here at 5 cents. And then when I put out my buy alert, you know, it pumped a little bit, uh, pumped to like 13 cents. And then when Token Metrics found it, they pumped it from 13 cents to 50 cents, where it's at right now. It's a whoop. That was Token Metrics. So let's see, who's going to be the next influencer to pump the bags of Mint Layer? It's still pretty cheap. You know, it's 30 million market cap. And as long as Ordi and the BRC20s keep pumping, there's so much potential in Mint Layer because it's a Bitcoin layer too. Uh, do any other on this list look good or are they scammy? Uh, I would say Joystream. I, I like Joystream. I have some and I, I think they support Joystream as well. You know, Token Metrics is pretty, is pretty legit. I haven't used their service, but there's a guy in my group on my ultimate tier who shares me some reports from Token Metrics. It's legit. Like the, the, the type of research they do on the tech and the code and the audits they do, checking the GitHub, checking the team, checking the narrative, the pumping potential. I actually really like Token Metrics. They're not bad. I think they're decent. So if you want to check out Token Metrics, their channel uh, and whatever paid services they have, it's, it's decent. You know, they're, they're really not that bad. I kind of like token metrics. Uh, some respect. What's up, dude? One of my ultimate members. Great to see you here, man. Mint layer to 20x over the bull run? Even more. I mean, if if mint layer uh, hits the same market cap of ordinals, that's um uh, 1 billion divided by 30 million. So that's, let's see, 3 times 10. It's over 30x. And that's just now. That's not even like long term. That's just now. It's 30x. In the bull run, we could look at 200x, 300x. Because um, like Token Metric said, which I agree with, the, the fundamental of la uh, Mint Layer plus the team and the tech, it has potential to reach the top 50 of the market cap because it's, it's like a polygon. Polygon is a layer two for ETH and Mint Layer is a layer two for Bitcoin. So it's a really strong fundamental. Ordinals is already a 1 billion plus market cap in the top 70. The, the sky's the limit. I, I think Mint Layer has the potential to hit the top 50 market cap. So that's way over 20x. That's that's over 100x. Elon Musk in the chat. Whoa. Most wealthy people in 2025. One, Jeff Bezos. Two, Crypto Galaxy. <laughs> History likes to repeat itself. An anniversary of the Great Depression is in a few years. Make your money off the next bull run and don't hold. Oh no, guys, the recession is coming. Cake is the great. He says that history will repeat itself. We're going to have the next recession. Oh no, we're all going to be homeless. Oh. <laughs> Crypto Archie tweeted about Cap. What do you think? Because you have opposite views on Lit. 
Dude, I, I don't think Lit Labs is terrible. It's fine. Like, I would give Lit Labs a, a C minus. You know, it passes. It's not a scam, but it's also not great. Uh, Cap, I don't know much about what, I don't know what that is. Uh, Joy and ZDX, yeah, they're, they're pumping, man. They're looking good. Yeah, Lit, Lit Labs is fine. It's, it's, it's not good enough to make my HMs on my general top seven, but for my gaming coins list, yes, I can put Lit Labs in an honorable mention, but I'm not going to buy it. it. It's just whatever. It's, it's super mediocre. Well, it's not bad. Um, Block X is a scam. Mm. And that's because the team is anonymous. Before you ask me about a crypto, you have to check if the team is doxxed. If it's an Anon team, I'm never going to consider it. I'm going to call it a scam, and I'm just going to slap you. I don't buy cryptos with Anon teams. I, I just don't do it. They're all scams. How are you going to trust? Like, you can barely trust crypto in general. So how are you going to trust a crypto that has an Anon team? CG, what's up, brother? Went full on Casper five months ago. Thanks to your streams. Came by to say thank you. Did a big help. Awesome. Great to hear. Congratulations. Bought a small bag of bonk two weeks ago. Made it 2x. Very nice. Good job, genius. How does ArcBlock have Coinbase? Because you can just pay money and list on Coinbase. You can do anything for money. I don't know what a Coinbase listing costs. Maybe a million dollars, maybe two million, but it costs a lot. All the normies on Twitter are wondering why their XRV bags are not pumping. <laughs> That's so sad, but it's so true. The XRP normies, they believe XRP will hit $100 and it's only 66 cents. It's barely even moving. Like it's hardly been moving ever. It's just a flat line. I've been in crypto for like nine years and XRP has never done anything like XRP had a good initial bull run. But after that, it's been done. Like last bull run, I had XRP. I bought it at 20 cents. It pumped to a dollar and I was like, wow, this sucks. A, a 5x return on XRP. Dude, I could make a 5x. As you can see, I have made a 5x in a month. <laughs> in a month on Neon. I made a 5X on Mint Layer. I made a 5X on GFAL, Caspaw, all in a month or two months. Man, when are the XRP normies going to wake up? You got so many calls, right? My man, thanks, man. Appreciate it. I did not get them all right, but I get most of them right. So I think it's pretty good. As long as I can like hit a 80% success record, that I think that's great. I'll take it. 80% is better than, you know, 10%. I've seen YouTubers who only have a 10% success track record. I'm just like, oh my God. Been busy, haven't had been in lives lately. My job rugged me, <laughs> my free time. This guy and his damn Jesus coin. I know, I know, he's so annoying. It's like, dude, you don't need religion in crypto. It doesn't make any sense. Like, why would you do that? Beam swap, Clint. Is a thousand X? <laughs> I don't think Get so. Out. <laughs> Get, out. Get out. Hello, pumping. I know. I know. It is. Hello is like really pumping. Holy crap, dude. What is happening with the hello? I'm really tempted to buy more. Oh my gosh, it's 16 cents. No. Oh, I was going to buy more. Dang it. Oh, it pumped a lot already. No, I missed it. I'm so mad. Oh, well, I have a lot of hello, so I can't complain. I have a big bag. Dang it. I was going to buy more. Dang it. I thought it was going to pump and it pumped. See, it's a good problem to have when all your bags keep pumping and you, you get mad. You did not buy enough of it. That's a good problem. It's better to have that problem than to like get a rug pull and then it goes to zero and you're like, oh crap, I just lost everything. Have you looked at Fanks kind of like an OnlyFans crypto? That's like really stupid. I'm not gonna look at that. Use common sense. You really think that's gonna be a hundred X? What MC did you get on ZTX? I think it was under 50 million.
Hello, Stephen Bate. Hello, what's up? What is popalopin? Or should I say what is popaladopin? Or what is pumper lumpin? Crypto's Archie tweeted cat. Man, dude, if you say the same thing again, I'm gonna ask a moderator to ban you because you can't repeat the same comment seven times or you're just spamming the chat and it's really annoying. Get on the VIP, guys. Yes, Dowski. A man of wise words. You must get on the VIP membership. You just got to do it. Do it. Just do it. Everyone in the membership says that it paid itself off in the first, like, month. I think this is too cheap. Man, only 99 bucks? That is really cheap. Like, when I hear someone say they put in $2,000 and then they made a 7X, it turned into $14,000. I'm like, wow, what? You made 12,000 bucks profit in your first month? How am I only charging $99? Oh, well. Take advantage of it if you want to. Sounds like Mint Layer should be number two. It sounds like it, but that's just right now. There's so much hype. The hype's going to die. I'm just being honest. The hype's going to go down. It's just, it's just super hyped up right now because of token metrics. Why is change in the scams list? I mean, like, it's not an all-out scam, but it's a horrible investment. It never pumps. It's freaking old, and the fundamental is terrible. It's, it's just useless all around. It's not bad, but it's not great. Oh, yeah, SDEX looking good. I, I have SDEX on my watch list. I think SDEX has potential. I'm keeping an eye on it. I might buy some. Dude, this looks bullish. Like, if you want a short-term pump, just go buy some SDEX now and thank me later. This looks bullish. This is ready to pump. What are our risks when ML launches mainnet? I have seen some posts in... What? Oh, what do you mean? Risk in terms of what? I mean, when the mainnet comes out, you're probably going to have to do a swap for the mainnet tokens. <clears throat> to get Crypto Galaxy's gems before anyone else finds them. Be a member and join us on the membership. Yes, well said. <laughs> Wise words. You got to do it. Just join before everyone else. Because the last gem that I bought, which... I haven't really revealed yet in ZTX. Buy alert went out at 2.7 cents. What is ZTX now? And that was like three days ago. No, wait, that was two days ago. Now it's 3.6 cents. So now all the cheapskates who watch me in the free public, public YouTube live streams can pump my bags after it pumped. Thank you very much to the cheapskates. Pump my bags for free. What are your thoughts on cell frame? <laughs> scam. It's a horrible scam. It's a rug. <laughs> Have you seen the chart? Is Luna a scam? Yes. It's another rug. Man, I really, I'm losing hope in you people. Asking about rug pulls? Like, get out of here. Suka, that's another scam. Oh my god. Booked after one month into VIP. Great calls and gain. Sign up. Just do it. Yes. <laughs> They'll figure it out, Joe. Th they'll figure it out eventually. They'll figure it out. Uh, thanks for the honest work, brother. In the last bull run, even Litecoin and Bitcoin cash did over 15x. I know the returns are low, but more on the safer side. Well, if you want to save 15x, you may as well just get Bitcoin or get Ethereum. Dude, Litecoin was terrible. Litecoin did not do 15x. That's not even true. I had Litecoin and it was awful. I can't believe I let the YouTubers show me on this. Dude, Litecoin pumped to $350 from like $50. That's a 7X. Maybe if you're like really lucky and you perfectly timed the spike of the top, you could hit a 10X. There's no way that freaking Litecoin would give you a 15X. Litecoin was like a, a 7X at best. And that's, that's crap. 15X is terrible. I have seen posting in VIP about risk concerning coin transfer when mainnet launches. What's the scoop? What? What risk is there? They haven't even launched the mainnet yet. Like, no one knows what's going to happen. People are just freaking out over nothing. Like, nothing has even been announced yet. 
When will Casper list Binance? <laughs> I don't know. I need to get an eight ball for that. Who knows? There's been a lot of crap going on because Cheng Peng Zhao, uh, you know, got sued and he had to step down. So I don't know. It'll take time. Hey, CG, the way you talk about your crypto earnings, multiples make stocks <laughs> look like garbage. I know. <laughs> stocks are terrible. As soon as I found crypto, I sold all my stocks. I, I sold everything. I sold all my stocks and I put it all in Bitcoin and ETH right away. Um, I think ETH was $80 and Bitcoin was $5,000 when I first did that. And I was like, oh, thank God. The stocks are awful. I sold all my stocks. I sold my 401k. I sold all my long-term, you know, fiat investments. They're all crap. They're all so bad. Real world assets sucks, dude. I hate real world assets. It's a scam narrative. I do not recommend that. Yeah, we're pump a lump in. You know it. I have seen, oh uh, yeah, we already read that. Do you have any thought, idea what is happening? 1212 regarding Arion. Oh, uh, good question. So Arion has some pretty big news coming out. Um, hmm. I think it's going to be the mainnet getting launched. That's all I can think of. Um, probably not an exchange listing because usually area does not control exchange listings, right? They can influence exchange listings and they know it will come, but they can't really announce a date for an exchange listing because only the exchanges know when the actual date is for the listing. So if I had to guess, it's going to be the mainnet launch, which is super good. You know, hopefully area gets the mainnet launched and that's going to start pump in the bags. I, I, I believe in area. I really do. ICP to the moon. Some people are still blind, still believing in the normie coin. All thanks to CG. May God bless you, bro. Thanks. <laughs> Get on the VIP. $1,000 profit in three weeks. Nice, Jacob. That's great, dude. Man, 1000 bucks profit in three weeks. That's crazy. Man, some people are really missing out. Oh, but bro, 99 bucks is too much. <laughs> really? Get out of here. Get out. What do you mean 99 bucks is too much? There's no better channel on YouTube than this. Do yourself a favor and join. I'm already up 3x on the portfolio. Congrats. 3x of portfolio is, is awesome. Sorry for the spam. Okay, cool. You're, you're, you're forgiven. This is my first time on your channel. I'll join the VIP tomorrow. Awesome, man. Looking forward to seeing you in my Discord. Seems like the gaming coins are taking their turn pumping. Yep. We are in the gaming pumps right now. It's all about the gaming coins. What's happening? I am a Caspa Maxi and people are saying, see, you have to be more diversified. <laughs> oh man, that's the dumbest advice I've ever heard. Oh, but bro, you have to be diversified. What if one of them goes down? It's like, no, dude, get out. <laughs> you only have to be diversified if you're stupid. If you don't know which cryptos are better than others, if you have no idea what you're doing, then yes, you gotta diversify. Warren Buffett said diversification is for the know nothing investor to protect themselves from their own ignorance and, to, and stupidity. There's no, there's no need to diversify. If you know what the best crypto is, you just go all in. This is why I have over 80% my portfolio in Caspaw, and this is why I'm up in so much profit. Because I believe in it and I know what it is. My whole portfolio has been mainly Caspaw for an entire year. Like since January this year, it's just been all cast ball. Waiting to censor Jesus. <laughs> hey, what's up, Ness? Welcome to the stream. Yeah, hit the like button, please. Hit the like. Smash the like button or get slapped. Take your pick. What are your thoughts on this? What are your thoughts on that? Andreas, did you read the forbidden list of comments? You shall not say, oh, what are your thoughts on this? Oh, have you heard of that crypto? Hey, guys, what's your opinion on this? Like, no, no, no one cares. Nobody cares. Literally no one. I've only bought on Uphold, but they don't have a lot of crypto that you talk about. So what other exchange would be a good choice? So if you're on Uphold, 
you got to sign up for Mexi and get a VPN. Set your VPN location to Belgium. I have a link down below for NordVPN. That's what I'm using. And then use the VPN, sign up for Mexi with your email, not your phone number. Do not try to KYC. Do not try to verify. Do not attach any credit cards, debit cards, no bank accounts. Just transfer uh, a crypto from Uphold to Mexi. Like you can transfer... XRP, you can transfer Caspa, you can transfer ETH, you can transfer whatever you want straight from Uphold to Mexi. And that's how you fund your account. That's how we're all doing it. That's the DGen life, yo. Fund your account through the KYC exchange and then send that crap to Mexi and buy your scam coins. I'm pumping your bags. Thanks for the free alpha. <laughs> Thanks for the pumps. I'll take the pumps on my bags. Lord Frost, thank you for the $2. What you like about Peppy? Um, Peppy's listed on all the big exchanges. That's what I like about it. Tell me another meme coin that got listed on Binance in the first month of listing. Peppy's on Binance, Kraken, Gemini, and Crypto.com. It's on literally every exchange except Coinbase. And what I've seen in the bull run is that if a meme coin is listed on Coinbase, I mean, holy pump a moly. It's going to go straight up parabolic, god candles, Big green pumps. It's just going to go 100x. So if Pepe gets Coinbase before the next bull run and the Coinbase normies pump it, it's going to pump a lot. You can't get pumps on your crypto unless you have giant exchange listings because most of the money that comes into crypto comes from stupid people's bank accounts that they attach to the big normie exchanges like Coinbase and Binance. So when they connect their bank account to Coinbase and they send in a d deposit of, you know, $20,000 cash, they can pump your bags. Multiply that by like 50,000 people across the whole world are just going to pump your bags. So it's a meme coin. Pepe's going to stand out if it gets on Coinbase. There's not many meme coins to buy and people love meme coins. There's only Doge and Shiba. That's it on Coinbase. There's nothing else. On Binance, you only got Doge, Shiba, and Floki, and uh, maybe it's going to get Baby Doge. I can't remember if it has it or not, but there's hardly any meme coins available on the big exchanges, and Pepe's one of them. And Pepe's the newest. That's why I pick uh, I pick Pepe over Doge and Shiba. Dude, I hit like 200x on Dogecoin last bull run, and I had no idea what I was doing. I was like, wow, you can actually make 200x? Yes, certain meme coins are just going to do well. Do you believe Metaverse being a great narrative for the bull run? Yeah, Metaverse is going to have its run. It is, like always. Metaverse did really well last bull run too. Look at um Decentraland Mana. Dude, that thing did 1,000x last bull run. Isn't that crazy? Decentraland Mana. This is the most successful pump and dump scam coin in the Metaverse. It pumped from $0.03 cents to $5. That's almost 200x. Dude, that's just crazy. And what do you know? Of course, it got Coinbase. It's got on Binance and it's on Kraken. So I think ZTX is going to follow the same path. It's going to list on all the big exchanges like Binance, Kraken, and Coinbase. All of the normies are going to FOMO into it. And I think ZTX can pump a ton. The Decentraland Mana all-time high market cap was 10 billion. What is ZTX right now? 60 million. So let's see, 10 billion divided by 60 million. 166x return on the money from today. If ZTX is the next Decentraland Mana. And as far as I can see, there's not many better options out there in terms of metaverse. So when it comes to my metaverse play, I'm picking, I'm picking ZTX. I was an XRP normie. And then I have 5x with Casper. <laughs> How old are you, CG? I'm 29. Keep up the good work, CG. Cast is solid. I wish I saw your channel when Cast was a cent. I've heard that a lot. Everyone says, oh, I wish I found your ca channel when Caspa was a cent. Well, better late than never. Because when Caspa was a dollar, people are going to say, oh, but bro, I wish I found your channel when Caspa was 10 cents. I feel deep in my heart that CG... Jerry Banfield collab is coming soon for Christmas. <laughs> Get out of here. Can you help me build a 10x portfolio? I can. 
If you really want like customized uh, portfolio help and like direct contact with me, would recommend get on my ultimate membership because I can give you 24 seven direct support with anything you need, like literally anything. I'll help you out. I'll get you set. So check out the ultimate membership. I have really limited time available and limited spots. So I'm only taking two more people on this membership because right now I, uh, I have 58 members on the ultimate membership. Would recommend it. Hello, 54 year old single parent mom from Bristol. Killing crypto since I found you. Wow, nice. Congratulations. And welcome from Bristol. How many X do you expect from ZTX? I just said 166X. That's just insane. As long as there's 100X potential, you know I'm going to buy it. When would you say a crypto is old? Uh, if it came out before 2022, definitely old. How much Caspa do I need minimum to be rich? Just cutting right to it. How much do I need to be rich? I don't know. Get as much as you can. Just bought some SDEX. Nice. I think SDEX could be a, good, a pretty good play short term. Bro, I joined your VIP this week. Bro, I'm so happy. My only regret was not joining before. Thanks, Galaxy. Yeah, anytime. Crypto Susa. Glad you joined the membership. What will Casper have to hit before you make a million off of it? A secret. I'm not going to tell you, Ryan. Ness says, I am back on VIP CG. You have helped me make some health healthy gains in only a month. Thank you. Yeah, anytime, Ness. Glad to help. <laughs> if ZDX hits on top, I'll do a lifetime sub <laughs> to CG. All right, man. I have one stock left. Any still got hopium for this Bitcoin miner that spent a lot of money in the beer. The bear to get set up for mining could be a unicorn. Any? A stock called any? I don't even know what that is. I don't know anything about stocks. Do you have a favorite AI play? No, I don't like AI. I think AI is super overrated. I don't think it's good, honestly. I, I think it's trash. Gaming launch pads? That's terrible. That's a scam, dude. Yes, hello is at all time highs. You know it. If any of my bags are at all time highs, we got to pump it up and we got to pull it up. Let's go. Pump it up for hello, guys. It's pumping. Let's go. Woo. Pump it up. Hello's at the all-time highs. Do 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 do. Don't you know? Pump it up. You gotta pump it up. If you don't have any hello, you can pump my bags. Thank you. Woo! Pump it up. I bought hello at three cents and four cents, and it's pumping. I'm up four x the money. Looking foolish. Let's get up, give it up for Hello. Hello gets the spotlight. Is it right time to entry in Caspa? Long term? Absolutely. You got to pump it up. Da, 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 da. Jason. Jason, thank you for the $2. Chances of Bonk getting on a big exchange, including Coinbase. It's there. Uh, it's It's got an uphold. Dude, if you can list on uphold, anything can happen. I don't think Bonk has any other exchanges that are big. Uh, it just has KuCoin, Gate, Bybit, Hoobie, BitGet. It's a small chance, but it is possible. The fact they got uphold, that's that's pretty bullish, so we'll see. Um, Could take another year or two. I don't know. Chances, uh, if I had to guess, I'd say 25% chance, which is not bad. It has a chance, so it's, it's decent. You know, I might I might buy some bonk. Not now. I'll wait for a pullback, but I might get some. EJ, thanks for the $5. What are your thoughts on Gamble 5? Probably a scam. 
Anything with ga gamble in the name is terrible. Uh, slept on in gaming sector offers real world revenue and use case. I like BCB with 100% profit share. Yeah, that just sounds like a scam. That just, everything you sound, said about it sounds like a Ponzi. 100% profit sharing, gambling. That's just awful. I'll go take a look. Maybe I can save you your money if this is a rug. It's not even listed on Coin Market Cap. Probably a major scam, bro. If it's not on CMC, it's super risky. Uh, no, do not recommend this one. Uh, Ness, thanks for the five dollars. My portfolio is simple. <laughs> Copy CG. What do you think about Joystream 3050X? I mean, you should not like blindly follow me, but if you want to, you can. Dude, I love I love Joystream. What are you talking about? What do I think about it? I think it's really underrated. Uh, Joystream is uh, I think ready to rip. Everything's been pumping except Joystream. I mean, it's kind of pumping. This is bullish, dude. This chart looks extremely good. Like it's just healthy growth. Uh, the volume is going up and it's getting new exchange listings every month. So they're doing everything right. I think it's due for a pump. 30 to 50 X. I no more than that. Cause the fully diluted market cap is only 50 mil and the current MC is 36 mil. Um, if this hits the same all time high as theta, cause theta was, uh, the biggest streaming crypto of the last bull run. That I also made 100x on Theta last bull run. Holy crap, dude. I made so much on Theta. I turned 700 bucks to 70 grand. So if Joystream is the next Theta to go to 10 billion. Divided by what? 36 million. We're looking at 277x return on the money. So you, you're saying 30x, 50x. I'm calling more than that. And if, if at a base case, at least it should do 30x. At least. Joystream is really underrated. Once Joystream pumps, you guys are going to be crying that you didn't buy any while I was talking about it. It's, it's really cheap. It's a good entry right now. Uh, hello. Would appreciate a look at Aggie. Oh, my God. I think it's a scam, dude. I've already seen this one. Which one is it? There's four of them. Uh, Jason, you got you to gotta specify, dude. It's like I type in a Aggie, and there's three of them. Like, which one is it? How am I supposed to know? Uh, Mirage, thank you for the five dollars. Hey, CG XPB proof of work. Okay, let's go see the uh, XPB. Pow blocks. It sounds stupid. Oh, chart looks good. Market cap is low. It's on Mexi. Is the team doxed? Because I swear, someone showed me this before, and I said, "Hey, you gotta tell me, is the team anonymous?" So do your own research, Mirage. Find out if the team is doxed, and then I'll give it serious consideration. Otherwise. Probably a scam. So let me know if the team is uh, legit. Elon Musk, I literally answered your question already in the beginning of the stream. Why are you repeating yourself? Did you even not watch the stream? Get him out of here. Jeez, Get dude. Out. I'm not going to answer your question twice. You got to rewind the stream. I literally answered you already. Dude, why are you buying crypto on Robinhood? <laughs> act like a man. You can act like a man. What's the matter with you? Who's buying crypto on Robinhood? That's not what you're supposed to do. That's that's a normie, normie move. Hey, CG, which one has a chance for short-term gain, Joy, ZDX, or ML? I don't know, dude. I don't know. Um, You definitely missed ML. Like, do not buy ML now because it's pumping right now. Um, I would say get some Joystream. It's, it's the cheapest entry. So number one, Joystream, number two, ZDX, and number three, ML. Rio a scam. Yep, that sucks, dude. I hate Rio. I think it's terrible. Dude, Rio is like one of the most overhyped cryptos on Twitter. It looks like a rug. For the new guys, I'm a thousand bucks up since 16th of November. <clears throat> 10x in total since July. Thanks to CG. Join the VIP now. Yes, just do it. Do it. Dang. Just 10x do it. since July? That's just crazy. Yeah, some of these new people, the cheapskates, I call them, they're missing out on my VIP membership. You got to just join. It's only 99 bucks. And you can make 10x your portfolio like Jacob or a thousand bucks since the past three weeks. 
dude, a thousand bucks, you could sign up for the year, like on nine ninety nine a year. Like if you just commit yourself to it and you just do it, you can make a thousand bucks easily. Jan says the bonk correct correction already happened. <laughs> I, I, I beg to differ. I, I don't think so. This literally went straight up. How is this a correction? Where's the correction? I don't see the correction. How is this a correction? It's literally at the top. I, I think this is not a correction. You call that a correction? Dude, this thing went straight up parabolic. I don't know what you're smoking. Nacho Key said, I sold hello early. I would say slap me, but it went into ML and Neon. Oh, but you sold hello early. You sold it. Oh, man. You know what I got to do. I have no choice. If you sold hello early, you know what's going to happen is this. How could you dare sell early? I'm disappointed in you. Why alluvium scam? Because it looks like a rug. It's like negative 97%. CG most influential crypto YouTuber. I like Archie as well, but only since time he switched to CG strategy of picking good projects. Before that, following him cost me a lot of loss. Dang. I think Archie's not a bad guy. I like him. He has some good picks. Hi, your narrative favorite. Layer ones, layers twos. Those are my favorite. Layer one, layer twos. Jericho, thanks for the 125 super chat. Yo, CG, have you checked on souls? Stocks, devs, game is on Steam. One million market cap. All right, let me go see. I've never heard of this. The uh, unfettered souls kind of looks like it rugged, but I guess it's having a bit of a dead cat bounce. It's on gate. It's on Mexi. Okay. I don't know, man. It looks really sketchy. Like, why did it dump on the launch? And it's kind of pumping. Oh, let's see. It's on the Polygon chain. Interesting. What does this do? Is this a one-off game? I, I hope it's not just a one-off game. Dude, I hate one-off game cryptos. Oh my god, no. No. Get him out of here. Get out. I the only gaming coins I like are like huge ecosystems or blockchains where you can build on it. But a, a one-time game is is really bad. I I don't I don't believe in those. Now don't get me wrong, you can make short-term gains on these, but um, long term, you're you're taking a huge risk that I'd rather just not take. So I don't recommend this. XBB team not doxed. All right, that's a scam. If you continue to find amazing gems that pass your scam tests and chart is good at it. Will you keep adding new coins to say your 20 picks or would you score them and drop off the worst even if it beats 99% of norms? I'll keep holding everything. I'm not going to like sell certain bags to go put into other bags. I'll, I'll keep holding everything. The only time I'm going to sell something is if there's something super sketchy about it and I think it's about to collapse. But now if you want to sell early for profits, you can do it. There's nothing wrong with that. Just keep in mind that I might just hit the coffin video for you for selling early. I don't sell anything unless there's something extremely suspicious. <laughs> Is your drug dealer doxxed? Oh, the super chat about GambleFi was asking about blockchain bets. Um, I mean, that also sounds like gambling, so it's probably also just as bad. Uh, let's go see, blockchain bets. Oh, it's bumping. Really low market cap, good tokenomics. It's got Mexi. Oh my God, this is way too old. I mean, check this out, right? It only has one central exchange listing after 11 months. That's terrible. 
this means that they don't pay for any more exchange listings. Like if you only have, if they only paid for one exchange in 11 months, what, what, what tells you they're going to pay for more exchange listings? It's very unlikely. They're probably really stingy and cheap or they're just stupid. So I'm not going to buy this one. This is terrible. Scam, scam, scam. Mm. Can you do a review on ICP? <laughs> yeah, it's a rug. That's my review. So no, thanks for the two dollars. Suncoin gonna list on Mexi the first week of January twenty fourth. Cool, man. Looking forward to seeing it. Bit three me. Thank you for the ten dollar super chat. A little something for all the ML profits you made for me. Hey, let's go. Congratulations on the mint layer profits. I believe we're all up in profits. Holy pompa moly. 49 cents from 5 cents. That's just crazy. And even the cheapskates who watch my free YouTube, even they could have bought it at 13 cents. And they would have made a 3x. But the VIPs, they got it at 5 cents. And they're, they're up 10x. That's just nuts. Review Samo. It's a scam, dude. I've... I reviewed it yesterday. It looks like a pump and dump. It's four years old and it's so freaking old. It's a scam, dude. No, it's a pump and dump. It's down like negative 97%. It, it looks terrible. Please do not buy Samo. Please sell it. Get rid of it. <clears throat> oh, Alex Becker pumped it. Okay, interesting. If Alex Becker talks about something, I'm not going to buy it. Like, definitely not going to touch it. Don't you think Joystream had most of its gains right now? Only went up? Yeah, only went up. The, but have you seen the market cap? It's $36 million. That's really cheap. The market cap is still a micro. Oh, by the way, uh, collab with Archie is tomorrow. I know you guys are talking smack about Archie, but I, I like Crypto Archie, and I'm going to do a collab with him tomorrow. I understand you guys are like, oh, man, some of his picks were dumping, and I didn't like this and that one, but like, he still has some good picks. He's a pretty decent crypto investor. He's a good guy, and he has a better understanding of crypto than like 99% of other people I've seen on YouTube, and he's not a paid chiller. He's, he's still a decent guy. Like, just because you have a pick here or there that starts dumping doesn't mean that he's a bad guy. Area is waking up. Yeah, it kind of is. Uh, how and where do you store ZTX? You can put it on Tanjum. You can just search it on your Tanjum uh, list of tokens, and you can find it. It's easy. Just search Tanjum. Or you can also put it on one key if you want. One sick puppy. What's up, dude? Steven Bate. George K. Sai? No, Sai is, Sai is, Sai is bad, dude. That's a, it's a normie coin. Wait, is Sai a normie coin? I can't remember. Maybe it's a... Is that a micro cap? Oh, yeah, dude. This is a half billion market cap. That's a normie. Normie coin. Hell no. I only buy one... Sub one million market caps. <laughs> YOLO. <laughs> <laughs> That's the D-Gen life. I used to do it. I used to do that. I used to only gamble on coins that were sub 1 million. Would you rather ha hold a, a bag of Myria or G-Fowl? G-Fowl, of course. Like, just look at the list. Where do you see Myria? Myria is all the way down here on the HMs, and g is all the way up here, number two. Like, clearly, I'd pick g over Myria. That's just obvious. Like, come on, man. Read the list. Cap? I, I think I saw Cap. I didn't really like it. It's just whatever. <laughs> yeah, Archie's picks are super degen. Like, we're different kinds of traders. He does a lot more uh, micro caps and risky plays. I usually just do, like, kind of safer, you know, higher market cap plays. Like, not higher, but the market caps of my cryptos are usually 2 to 60 million, 2 to 50 million. Usually my plays are, like, 20 million market cap. 
Archie's got some super degen picks, right? Like you got to really do some research or make sure you're early in the buy alert. If you follow his picks, he's got very micro cap picks, like very micro cap. And he still does his due diligence on his checks. He checks is there's a docs team. Is the chart not looking like crap? Does it get, does it got some exchange listings? He's still doing some decent checks. So um, even after that, there's anything can go wrong, but I think he's still got like, okay picks. But with Archie's picks, if he's calling a lot of random micro caps, you only put in like 20 bucks, you know, don't, don't put a whole lot because not all of his picks are long-term. You only have $99 a month VIP only. Um, are you saying that like it's too cheap or like it's too expensive? I don't know how you're saying it. Or you, I, I don't understand. I mean, I have another tier that's $4.99, but you're probably not going to want that. <laughs> if you think this is too expensive, then a crypto is not for you. You, you got to spend money to make money. Playable, a good one? Nah, not really. I it, It's just whatever. I mean, it's not bad, but I don't like it. What I do like, though, is my membership. Dude, my Discord is pop a What's up, people? Jacob in here. The numbers on the thumbnail are made up. And clickbait. Of course they're clickbait. I always like to clickbait people. Yeah, you guys are, uh, if you're not in the membership, you're missing out on the Discord. This is where it's at. We got over, I think we we're, I think we just hit 1,000 members. Or we hit 900. Pretty good community here, if I do say so myself. Solid community. You can find whatever you need to find. Like, whatever you want to do, it's going to be here. You have watch lists in your Patreon? I'll post it sometimes. VRA, a scam? Yes, that's a scam. It's a pump and dump. SDEX making a move? Is it because of me? Because I said it was good? Who's buying SDEX? Holy crap, dude. It's pumping. Oh, not really. I mean, SDEX is okay. The, the problem with SDEX is that the market cap is already 97 million, and it's a DEX, and I think DEXs suck. So it's just whatever. Like, I, I think the chart's pretty good. I think it has potential, but I don't know, man. It's just kind of misses some boxes for me, but it's fine. Like, it's okay. Not bad. I have a lot of medical bills to pay, so I'm on a severe allowance. Dang. Um, if you have a lot of medical bills to pay, you should probably get off YouTube, stop doing crypto, and go get a job. You should not be here. All right. Do, do. Thank you for watching today's episode of the Crypto Galaxy. Welcome new subscribers, Ilker, Fabio, Anasa, and Jail. Super Chats, thank you guys, Ness, Jason, Mirage, and Jericho. Thank you for the donations. I know a lot of them are missing. I don't know why my software is really buggy. So let me go through the list manually. Hold on. Thank you, EJ. And also Sanol Crypto and Bit3Me and KPAX. Thank you guys for the donations and thank you everybody for watching. There we go. Put the live counter up there. Oh, you can't even see me. My hand's covered. Whatever. What I miss. All right, thanks for watching, guys. Check out the VIP membership first link down below in the description so you don't miss the next gem. Just do it, just join, and I'll see you guys in the Discord.